It's Bourbon Night. Hello, I'm Chad. I'm Sarah. Oh. <laughs> and welcome to the 25 most notable bourbons in American, American whiskey, rye. American rye 2021. Oh, 2021. Hello, my name is Sarah. You already, already said that. I'll draw. <laughs> Today, the dog wants to know. Today we'll be having William Weller 2021. What a day to mess up on! <laughs> the WLW day! We're back today with a big one, or a little one in this case, I guess, William LaRue Weller from this year. Yeah. So all we have, which we're not complaining, because it's some, probably more than most people have, um, is this media sampler, which they were kind enough to send us upon request. So it's 125.3 proof, and this is all that remains. The rest of it, we did, you know, when we did the video on the BTAX, and then some of it's gone into our blind contention sample bottle. Yeah. So this is it, so, so why don't you? <laughs> well, there is, there is more in our world, but as you said, it's in a sample bottle that we don't know where it is, and we won't know until we have ranked it and scored it, and then that is revealed, so. See how it does. It did rather well last year. I mean, I think that's kind of to be expected, but it was also blind, so I think some people would say, oh, you just picked it because it was BTAC, and I'm like, well, we didn't know which one was which, so it just happened to blow us away. Yeah. I love him being very scientific, very measured without measuring, because he knows I'll look. And I know you all will look. Uh, they're pretty much even. Yeah. Also, notice our, well, we'll talk about these later, but we, yeah. we picked a special glass for a special pour for the last of it. Yeah. Okay. Oh my goodness. I mean, this is just what okay. you want every mm. nose to be like, but yeah. then it wouldn't be special, right? Right, right, yeah. So rich, and it's almost like you can t you can smell the texture that it will be on your tongue when you nose it. You, t you can, I'm salivating. <laughs> yeah, I lost for words. I don't you know wanna... what it's like? It's like when you take the, um, the top off of a, a cake holder, and then it's something like a carrot cake or something like that that and just rushes, wafts into yeah. the air. You're like, yes. Ooh, it's like you that. guys, I really want brownies now. I don't know why. <laughs> no, I want carrot cake. Okay. Man, it's just like. It does sort of have a cream cheese frosting yes, type of nose yes, to it. Yes, yes, yes. And brown sugar. It's just a tiny hint of like a cherry or a dark fruit, which we typically get with Buffalo Trace products. Maybe a, a very light nut in there. Hint of tobacco, mm -hmm. little leather. Mm, it does giving a very cake vibe though. You were right, like something that's not your usual. It's like very homemade. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I mean, I could sip all day with this nose. Just warm But this isn't an uncorking. And... Okay, here we go. I think we're making the case for why this belongs on the list. Here I mean, just shut up with that mouth feel. Uh -huh. Wow, right off the bat, you get the proof, but it is in such a wonderfully approachable way. You're like, yes, this has proof to it. It's 125.3, yes it is, but it's not like, oh, this is 125.3. It's no. just like, yeah. It just like feels like it's right where it should be. Uh, it's just... Words hard. Yeah, words hard right now. And I, I do think that, you know, so often these things are extra overhyped and stuff, but I totally see, like with Pappy's, you know, I don't really see it. I don't really get it. I understand, but I it's not, I don't relate. With these, especially like the George T. Stag and the William Leroux Weller, but the William Leroux Weller year after year has proven. Yeah, those are just, the, It just make, it's, makes you melt. Yeah, like, those are the two that, that have, in our book, have always shined from the, uh, the BTEC series of five. This year also we really like the Saz 18, which is, you know, something different, but we're, we're glad that it did. Yes. Uh, but yeah, typically WLW and George C. Stag. Now this year, of course, there was no George C. Stag. But do you agree, like, there are a lot of things that could potentially have been on this list that I think get more hype than they deserve? Yes. This is one where, while I don't like seeing it get overhyped, while I don't like seeing what it goes for on the secondary, yeah. this, I can more, I can relate to it. Mm -hmm. Still would never pay that much, but I see why this has been built up. You can still think about it and be like, I'm not saying I think we? it should be that no, way. I'm not no. saying I think it's a fair price to ask. I'm just saying mm. I can connect the dots um, mm. versus like with Pappy, I don't so much relate to those dots. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so, sec, second sip. But the mouthfeel is stupid. 
Here's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> don't come on this channel if you don't ex if you expect us to like talk bad about Willie Blue or Weller. Yeah. Probably not the channel for you. No. Um, I can't lie to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. You know the the other. See so here, here's the thing. Like we could have just said, well, it's um, if it's in the BTAC line, it's automatically gonna go in our best of the year contention, and not we put two of the five. Well, four this year. Well, two of the four. But we last um, year we put two of the five. Yeah, last year when it was George C. Stag and this, then we liked those the best. Those are the two that win it. We don't put anything or everything that's BTAC in there because because it's BTAC, right? Yeah, some of them were, eh, you know, good, but. But not what we would not call like this most notable of the year. Right, exactly. It's one of those where you know, I don't think this is the one that we drill down on the most and say we're getting this and this and this and this. There's a subtle simplicity that it's almost less said is better. Mm. It's just that definition of an exceptional whiskey in the dictionary. It's. It's a picture of WLW. And all the things. Most of the time. Yeah. All the things that we said on the nose, I feel like, are are also true on the palate. It's got a rich, desserty quality, but it's also super buttery and almost like a creamy, like that cream cheese frosting that you were talking about. And it's got, you know, like spiced cake notes, but it's also got, you know, dark fruit notes and notes of age, like leather and tobacco and the nice pronounced oak. But everything is just so well blended together. Mm -hmm. It's really hard to just drill down, like you said, into this note and that note. Yeah. It just kind of sings all together in harmony and it's an experience. Honestly, this is one of the ones that I would say like, if you're ever going on vacation or whatever, you're going on a trip and you wanna have one special pour like that you think you can get out of bar for a reasonable price and reasonable when it comes to BTAC is subjective but this is one that like i think someone should have once in their lifetime if Absolutely. you're a bourbon drinker and so if you have to save up once for a nice pour instead of chasing down a bottle mm -hmm. like this is one of the few things that i would recommend speaking of recommend uh, i had to bring up whiskeyambitions.com we recommend it these are our uh, crystal cut Glen Cairns. We have a limited amount of these still available on the site. But you can also get our regular Glen Cairns rocks glasses, copitas, water glasses, uh, t-shirts such as the one that I'm wearing, uh, hats, coins, uh, candles, and more. Always coming soon. That's whiskeyambitions.com. And I will just note that we will restock these, but they take eight weeks and they come from Scotland. Come from so Scotland. We only have a few boxes left until the end of the year, and then we will restock early next year. So them while I can. That's right. Um, you can also become a patron at patreon.com slash it's bourbon night. Join us for as little as one buck a month. Uh, that's where we do our barrel picks. You get after the episode exclusives like another round with Chad and Sarah. Um, that's where we talk about events that we're doing. So we'll start planning our 2022 events soon and more. There you go. All right, Sarah, do we even need to ask why? No. I think we've already talked about why I think why we've done a really good job. List. Yeah. Uh, so I think what most people have save your comment hate <laughs> i don't want to hear it what most people have come to this video for is because they watched yesterday's video where i i, I struggled to find the voice for mele kaliki maka so i'm going to try it again <sighs> okay and here we go mele kaliki maka is a thing you say on a bright hawaiian christmas day okay that's all. that's that's what you oh. get. That's what you get. I thought you were gonna keep going. No. I really settled in with this. <laughs> settled in for a long winter's nap. Yes. No, I hear you. Uh, if you didn't watch yesterday's video, that doesn't make any sense to you, but you can always go back and watch it. I just wanna enjoy this now. I am sad that there is no more. Again, mm -hmm. it is in a small sample bottle in the mix of all of our other blind samples, so we will have it at some point, but other than that, it is gone. Which is fine. Uh, sometimes, you know, you. This much of a great thing is fine with me. <laughs> um, I will accept. I'd like to have a lot more of it. But well, we'd like a lot of things, Chad, that's but true. I'd that's like true. to win the lottery, but. Well, we sort of did. With I mean, I kind of feel like we did with this profession. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it does feel like a bit. S sitting here sipping a William Leroux Weller out of some Crystal Glen Cairns, I kind of do feel like we won the lottery. Yeah. I know you oh. definitely did. <laughs> <laughs> say that and that's why it's so funny oh but isn't it true it's so true <laughs> whatever <laughs> hey uh this is this is where we're gonna leave it we better leave it uh if you haven't subscribed to us already you can do so by clicking right up here there's suggestions of other videos down here hope to see you in one of those thanks Sarah. thanks chad okay see you all tomorrow <laughs> until then drink more bourbon <laughs> <laughs>